In this problem we have a steel toll bridge that is 800 meters long at a temperature of room temperature. Now that's plus 20 degrees Celsius, plus 273 is 293 Kelvin. Now we're told that it's subjected to temperatures of minus 40 degrees Celsius and plus 40 degrees Celsius. So if we convert those to Kelvin, we get 233 Kelvin and 313 Kelvin. Those are our extreme temperatures. And we also know that the alpha for steel is 12 times 10 to the minus 6, 1 over kelvins. Now, we're asked to find the uh, maximum length of this bridge and the minimum length of this bridge due to its expansion and contraction. So we'll start with its low temperature. Now, the formula for expansion, delta L over L naught equals alpha delta T. So we're looking for delta L, which will be our how much it changes by. We want to add that to its original length to give us our final answer. So our final length is going to be equal to L naught plus delta L. So if we just kind of solve for L naught and put it in this equation, that will be what we need for to, to get our final answer. So that turns out to be L final equals L naught plus delta L. And delta L is just going to be, if we multiply L naught over to this other side, alpha delta T L naught. Alpha delta T L naught. I guess it's just delta T naught, delta T naught. Okay. So, if we want, we can uh, factor out L naught, but I'll just leave it in because this is pretty simple. So let's do do this first for our low temperature to see how much it contracts. So our original length is 800 meters plus alpha, which is 12 times 10 to the minus sixth, one over Kelvin. times our delta T, which is going to be, in this case, we have uh, 293, actually it's going to be T final minus T initial, uh, let's write this delta T equals T final minus T initial, so that if our final is smaller, then we're going to get a negative number, so it's going to be 800 minus. So we have T final of 233 minus T initial of 293, and that's a 60, uh, 60 Kelvin difference. So this delta T in this case will turn out to be minus 60 Kelvin. Now L naught, the original length is 800 meters. So if we plug all that into our calculator, we get a distance. So our L final minimum is 799.424 meters. And I asked to put this to three, three decimal places, so that's our final answer for the minimum. And we'll do exactly the same for the maximum, LF max. So we still have the 800 meters as our initial length. 12 times 10 to the minus 6, 1 over Kelvin. Now the difference this time is from, from 313 to 293. So this time it's positive 20 Kelvin. And then again, 800 meters. So our final length maximum, when we plug that in, is 800.192 meters. And those are your final answers.